So in this video, I want to talk about shortages and surpluses. So the normal supply and demand diagram we're used to seeing is the part that's in green and then in red. That we have demand, which is downward sloping, supply, which is upward sloping, and then we have an equilibrium price and quantity. So what happens if we fix price above the equilibrium? Let's say that we fix it at P1. Well, if we keep price higher than it would normally be on its own, then less people are going to want the good. Quantity demanded will be, so Q sub D will be quantity 1. And then too much of it will also be supplied. So Q sub S or QS will be Q2. So if, if price is too high, if price is too high, then we supply more than demanded. And I should say that this is the quantity supplied is more than the quantity demanded. And that's what we call a surplus. Surplus. So in this diagram right here, we would have a surplus of Q2, Q2 minus Q1. That would just be the difference between Q2 and, two and Q1, which we could represent by this little area right here. So that would be our surplus. Now what would happen if we fix price too low? Well, if we fix price too low, say down here at P2, and then we'll just go over right here, then we would get a shortage. And the shortage is when we have too much is demanded, so we'll call this Q3, and too little is supplied, so we'll call this Q4. So we had price was too high, then you supply more than you're demanded, and you have a surplus. And then also, if price is too low, is too low, then you will demand the quantity demanded. And I'm just going to write greater than, is greater than the quantity supplied. And that is called a shortage. And in this diagram over here, that would be Q3 minus Q4. So I'm not really going to do any examples with this. It's pretty self-explanatory, and with this diagram, I think that you've got it. If you want some examples, let me know, but I'm just going to leave it at that.